Or something over there, too, like right, right here. There's a white, misty looking shit. All right, we live. All right. Hey, guys. Uh, stand by a second. We're just getting going here. As usual, running late. <laughs> Let me switch this around. All right. So we're at the haunted William Heyman house here in Sutton, West Virginia. Sean's never been here before. Never been here. Uh, and then uh, he stopped in, cut his drive in half, and uh, hooked us up with uh, this place. Thanks to Teresa so much for having us. Yes. And um you know i've got i've been here a few times before guys and uh got some pretty interesting stuff got a lot of uh, stories from folks here that have had some downright creepy experiences and other you know just benign paranormal experiences so um nothing super negative here nothing there is a male presence that seems to be a little bit bullying and stuff at times but uh, we'll see what we can get and uh, go from there we're going to start right over there in that main room where we uh, got some stuff before. So just give us a couple minutes and we'll get rolling. Probably go over and do a spirit box right off the bat. Yeah. All right. I'm going to turn these lights off too. Get some infrared going. I'm gonna have to go out and get my IR light on here in a second. <clears throat> Appreciate you guys tuning in tonight. Happy Haunted St. Patrick's Day here from wild, wonderful West Virginia. Also guys, please uh, go check out the Scare Network at scarenetworktv.com, a new streaming platform that me and Billy are, my good friend Billy Lewis from Orange Street Films Bluetooth are putting together. Open. For Hold on, Sean's shit's talking now over there. So Sean's got a really new, cool piece of equipment from Gary Galka, one of three people that have one, really cool, and... uh Super cool of him to be able to get one of those. Um, so yeah, check out scarenetwork.tv and uh, got a lot of stuff. Sean's involved with it. Eric Eric Connor's involved with it. David Weatherly's involved with it. And new streaming platform we're doing and we're filming a buttload of content for it. So this is not gonna be on it. New toy alert. Yeah. All right. I'm ready when you are, bro. Let me go ahead and uh, I don't want to IR blind each other. So. Yeah. Guys, yeah, we're in the 1800s mansion. That place is absolutely beautiful. It's huge. So many different rooms to check out here. Um, so. We got four floors and a, yeah, three floors and a creepy basement. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get this new toilet going. Right All right. I've recorded children laughing in this house. A uh, couple of weird screams and some other things. Equipment, mel meters going off, um, all oh, kinds of things. There. Who's here with us would like to speak with us? Were you in the car with me before? Hey, turn the volume down on that for a second. Tell everybody about that little experience. Tell them about that experience you had. What? Tell them about that experience you had in the car. Oh, yeah. Um, on the way down here. Yeah, no, I was in the car and someone was hitting me on the head, like constantly tapping me on the And my hair was moving by itself. And, you know, this is something that's happened to me a couple of times before. Um, so I went live in the car and I, you know, did a makeshift spirit box on my radio in my car. And I asked, you know, who's with me? And 
they were asking for help. And I'm like, where are you from? Haman. And it said, free us, rescue, light. Um, and just continuously would be happy. I just feel like someone would take their head. And like, and then I felt like a pain that went from the middle of my head all the way to the front and in the right side. And I was wondering if somebody got hit in the head or fell or injured or that's how they died or something. Mm-hmm. And when I used the spirit box, it did say horse death. So mm-hmm. I don't know if someone fell with a horse or something. I'm not sure. Well, there is talk of this place possibly being a... Uh folks home and some sort of hospital for mentally ill people at one time so that's definitely possible somebody could have hit their head or whatever you know so um we don't know a ton of history on this yet teresa's still digging we do know there's a few deaths in the house um and and things so but in place this is full of energy it's old Spirits of the Haman House, come and talk to us, please. We're here to talk to you, communicate with you. If you have any messages for us, if you need help, tell us your name, Feel whatever you feel like telling us. Ooh, did you hear that, dude? What? The big freaking boom over there. Are you making noise over there? Hello, Alicia. Hello, Dory. Please, guys, if you feel like it, contribute, super chat, and all that good stuff. Is that what it's called on YouTube? I forget. <laughs> the what? The super, is it super chat? Yeah, it's called super chat. Yeah, super chat. If uh, you want to donate to the cause, you can hit me up on my PayPal channel. My PayPal, Dave Spinks. Dude, is that you? Did you kick the sofa? No. Dude, I didn't move. You're in a different chair. Yeah, I'm in a totally different chair. Someone just kicked the sofa. And I just felt it, like, push forward. Did you just kick the sofa I'm sitting in? Did you feel that? No. Because that's all I did was right there. No. I felt like my back actually jolted a little mm-hmm. bit. Come forward and speak. Okay. That's better if you do it on PayPal. How does it, do you have to activate Super Chats? Mine's telling me there's no Super Chat option. It says no Super Chat option. On mine. Haven't you got them before? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Well, you can donate on PayPal too, guys. Just look up uh, Real Supernatural on PayPal or Dave Spinks on PayPal. Did we just hear a woman? something? Project your energy through this device. Say what you'd like. Right now. Oh, sorry about that. I had a, something weird happened right there. Yeah, a little bit of a weird vibe coming over my body right now. It's definitely the energy is coming through. It's around me. Who's the gentleman that just spoke? What's your name? Hello, Tammy. Please share the stream, guys. Get some people over here. touching my head yes or no Are you one tapping me? Whoa.
Can you say yes or no if you were in the car with me on the way here? Yeah, they do, Hildy. He was me? It, it was it was me or he he was there. I couldn't make it out really quick. Yeah, my PayPal is top shooter1569 at Gmail. That's my account on uh PayPal guys. If you want to throw a donation, that'd be awesome. Five bucks, anything help. <clears throat> Please hit the thumbs up, all you guys that have already. Appreciate it. Please subscribe if you're new. Hit that sub button. Yeah. That's what I heard. Yeah, that's what I heard too. Is Mr. Heyman here with us? Yes or no? Ooh, that was kind of weird. You can show yourself. We'd like to see you. I'm in the living room. Is that what it said? That's what it sounded like to me. In the living room? Wouldn't this be the living room? This, yeah. Is it, uh, Mr. Heyman, if that's you, can you tell us what your job in town was? Who were you? Or who are you? What's your job? Who's the owner of this house? What's your name? Who made that loud noise over by the stairs or earlier? They did or I did? Mm. Can you tell us a name? Can hear that over there, dude. No. There's all kind of noises going on. Who's making all that racket over there? Dude, it was loud. I can't believe you didn't hear that in there. That's a new device um, that has a, it has an SB7 hook to it, Colette. I'm just getting used to it and trying to play around with works to get the best responses, but it takes the white noise out to not hear some of it. You're not hearing that. It takes a lot of it out. Yeah. Did you know we were coming here tonight? It's definitely responding after yeah. we asked the question. That's what's interesting to me. Even though it's not clear, it's definitely responding after we asked questions. That was me. Yeah. Yeah, you try and? I never really. 
subscribe and I'm gonna say no. Yeah. Right. Any spirits in this house want to communicate? Now's your chance. Is this another way, another frequency for you to be able to speak through? They need nursing home patients here with us. Any folks with mental disabilities here with us? The homeowner here with us. It's in addition to the SB7 to try to take some of the white noise out. How you guys all doing? Appreciate you just coming in, like this video, and share it out any way that you can. Much appreciated. Oh God. I'm just trying to get used to this new device. Gary Golko was nice enough to get it to me. Try to help and aid in some of the ITC we do with the SB7. So I've been toggling it back and forth. Actually, I'll see if I can just lower it. Let's move to that other room. There's a lot of there's a lot of action going on in there earlier. I had some crazy stuff go off in here last time. Get out. Anyone here with us? All right, there's a mirror there. There's a lot of mirror up there. Just trying to figure this device out. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you, Jacqueline. I'm gonna go grab it right now. this device to try to communicate? All right, so last time I was here, man, I put a rim pod right here by this mirror. I just had a weird feeling. I was sitting in this chair and uh, had a feeling like something was behind me the whole time. So I put this rim pod up here and um, it went off once, but then I, I took a break. I said, okay, if you want to touch the rim pod when I'm outside, go ahead. Right. And I went outside, I was talking to someone on the phone, and sure enough, dude, it was going off in here. Right. So we'll see what happens. All right, if you remember me from last time, there's another toy you can play with.
Any child spirits that have communicated with in the past, feel free. Come through and talk to us. You want to play ball? We've got a ball for you right here. Ready to go. I'll play ball with you, so we're Sean. I won't get up or something? Play ball with us. Actually, I'm going to put that thing on the snares, dude. See if they'll roll it down the stairs. That's like something. How many of you are here with us? Trying to come through now. Mm -hmm. Takes a lot of energy. Sometimes it takes a little time. You can roll the ball down the stairs. You can make a loud bang. You can do whatever you want. Mm -hmm. Got to try to help some of you tonight. That's probably why you came to me in the car. Dude, don't like the floor was just shaking like someone's walking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think maybe one of the spirits or some of the spirits in here actually. Why do you linger here? Why do you wander around this place? Did you like this place when you were alive or are you stuck here? Cracking noise is just taking out some of the white noise, so it's trying to get just the EVP rather than all the noise that comes through in the spirit box. No, we haven't done any EVP EVPs yet. <laughs> we're just going to switch up with a bunch of different things while we're here. Mr. Heyman here, or his wife, any of his wives. Someone was feeling some sort of molestation here. You know if that happened? 
I guess it's possible. <laughs> it's possible. Something bad happens to you in life here? Well, you know. We'll do some EVPs after. Start a minute or so. We'll run a kayak trap here in a second. You still want us to leave? No, leave in only five minutes. Yeah, I'm about 30 minutes from here, guys. Nice to know, guys. I do live streaming here on my YouTube channel. Tonight's the first night. Yeah. And we're filming all weekends for Scare Network TV. Two cool locations, guys. It's totally brought up. Yeah. All right, so you're hearing a little more white noise on this one. No, that's not it. Bluetooth already open. Waiting for Bluetooth connecting. Frick was that, dude? Did we hear that? What? Is there something right? over here to my right, dude. It was like, Ugh. Who just made that noise over here to my right? Bluetooth no one. Bluetooth already open. Waiting for Bluetooth connecting. <laughs> Is Mr. Heyman here with us right now? <laughs> Who's making all that noise earlier over here when we were in that room? Who's the old man? Who's the man in here that likes to stomp around and bully people? Tell us your name. Is this your house?
there anyone here with us that died in this house? Yes or no? Any women? Maria? Mm -hmm. Maria. Maria, what's your last name? Maria, did you, did you die in this house, Maria? Yeah. Someone's touching me right side of my face. Oh, I know. Oh, yeah. Who? Oh. Who's touching Sean? Yeah, I'm getting constant spider webs. I love you. Who's touching Sean? Can you tell us your name? Anyone have a message for us? What do you got to tell us? What you say? I don't know. I really feel like someone hit their head. I felt it in the car. I feel like it was did you did you hit your head? Yes. Whoa. What happened to you, sir? Did you fall? That was a clear voice we got on. Oh, let me see what was that. Did someone push you? It's been a weird feeling, though. I think. Were you a patient here? Yes or no? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm feeling definitely a weird feeling coming on me. Did you die from your head injury? It's the right side of my head. Oh, oh, Jesus. That's it, head? Yeah. So I'm just like, head? Yeah, a little bit. Jeez. In the car, it said horse death. Did you fall off your horse? I need multiple things. I feel a lot of energy around me right now. <clears throat> did, more, did more than one person die from a head injury here? Yes or no? Did someone die from a horse accident? Yes or no? Ooh. From the attic. He said the attic. Something just touched my neck too. What, what about the attic? We'll be up there later. Guys, there's so many rooms in this place. It is freaking huge. Huge. That's it, portal. Come up. <laughs> Come up. We will later. All right. <laughs> Who's up there, a man or a woman? Yeah, I feel like they are. Is it five or high? I don't know, but I definitely feel like there are children's spirits here. Oh, so yeah. like kids like There's definitely children's spirits. Like, how many kids are here?
Where do the kids like to stay in the house? In this house? Well. Well. Uh -huh. Do the, do the kids love to play and run around the house here? You know, whatever spirit it is, they're, they're trying to make you feel and connect with them about the right side of the head. It's, it's been like in the car, and now it's just like, feel it. It's, it's still good. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting a little work thing right here. You know, it's like, ooh, yes. Got like a little headache going right here. And now I feel like I can't breathe. Now someone's trying to tell me that they couldn't breathe. Who yes. got? Yes. Is that you, ma'am? I feel like my lungs are restricted right now. Did you have tuberculosis? Just asking for help. For help. Thank you. F you. I heard, I heard it. Yeah. I heard just the first part. Of yeah. It. Or like F it or something like that. How many children are in this house with us right now? Children's spirits that have passed on. Is it 12? I, I doesn't do, do I have to, this woman that's around me? She's elderly. I just saw her, she was reaching out and her hands were kind of shaking towards me. Like she wasn't mobile, she was very easy. Yeah. Is there an old woman next to Sean? Yeah. yeah. Tell, what's her name? She said, yeah. Can tell us her name, please. Pat. Pat? How old is she? Say a hundred? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> you hear that? I heard a hundred like that. I, I feel feel say hundred there's like a, at least a few spirits that are around me and I'm feeling so, spider webs. I'm feeling like it just says blood too when you're talking. They're like hovering around me right now. What did the old woman around Sean die from? I just saw the heart. I think you're right, Dory. Was it your heart? Heart. Horse. I heard, I heard horse. Horse. Sound like heart. Can you say it again? Where did you die from? Heart? Oh, a key word. Say it clear. Was your heart had like heart from here, like hundred percent? Did you have a heart problem? We're having a hard time hearing you. <laughs> Who's the person with the head injury? Who got their head hurt? That says music. Mm -hmm. Would you like to play the piano? Over here? You want to play the piano and hit a note? Yeah, I did hear, I heard, I thought I heard murder in there. What was that? Anyone, is anyone's name Joseph here? Pat again. Pat, that's, oh, that's, old, that's two lady. times called that. Is the old woman near Sean, is your name Pat or Patricia or Patty? What is it? Did you die from a, did you die from a heart problem? Hey, Kathy. 
behind you. What? Who are you behind? You behind Sean over there or, or me? You can also use this too. Show us where you're at. Who's the boss in here? Said Pat again, dude. Pat, where are you at? Creepy scream. <laughs> are you in the house with us right now, Pat? Or are you coming to us from somewhere else? What the heck was that noise? Did you hear it? Yeah. Uh, it was nasty. Scream, growl, nasty. Yeah. Who's the nasty growler man? Are you aggravated we're here? The woman has a voice there. Mm. Yeah, there's a little woman voice right before that. Are you angry we're here? Dude, the floor is shaking. You're not moving floor, are you? No, I'm not moving. It, I just felt two distinct, like, puts like someone's walking around and my chair was shaking. Two thumps. Who's in, who's walking around in here with us? I was a woman. Mm -hmm. I heard all kind of movement in here when we were sitting in there, like, loud. Anything anyone wants to tell us, now's the time. Who said that? Happy St. Patty's Day, everybody watching. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Please throw that donations up on my PayPal if you so wish. Every little bit of helps is appreciated. We are for anyone that just joined us, we are at the William Heyman House in Sutton, West Virginia, about 30 minutes from my house. I don't like now it's making me wonder if it's even on the house or something else, but I just saw a guy who's wearing white. I mean, you are telling me that this place is some sort of like nursing home. They think it was, they don't know for sure. There's a I lot of rumors see, around town. I, I saw a guy, a big uh husky guy, like pretty big, pretty uh big, big guy. And he looked like he's wearing like orderly clothes, mm. like white clothes, and he's not nice. And he's like angry. Did you did, did you work here when the old people were patients here? Whoa. Ooh, I can feel feel the anger. What are you mad about? Did you just not like your job and helping people? Were you miserable? Hello, Ada. What did he do? Is he not nice to the patients? Oh, there he goes, he's answering. Are you not nice to these elderly people? Are you the one stomping on the floor that I keep feeling?
The older lady was just saying he was so mean. That's what she just said to me. I could see her holding her chest and she was shaking. She's like, he was so mean. What did he do to you? If that's you, Pat. Well, I hope you can feel comfortable to know that I will do anything I can to help you tonight. And anyone else that wants it. Patsy, were you the one tapping me on the head? In the car? That was a woman. Were you one of the ones in the car with me on the way here? You said, free us, rescue. Is that what you wanted me to try to do? What did she say? I don't know, the loud voice before that even said fight or right. Was that guy mean to you guys? Did you hear that? Mm -hmm. That's a loud part. Who was the mean one here? Give was his name. Don't be scared of him. Is he the one snarling at us? I heard a unique name too in my head. Devin. Devin? Devin with a B. Bevin? Yeah. Is his name Bevin? I don't know. That might be a female's name, I think. Who's Bevin? Is the mean bully holding you guys here, keeping you hostage? Anyone need help? Say your name. Say yes. Say something. What did he do to you? You said he was mean. Ooh. What did he do to you? Whoa. I thought they said run. Does he not want you to tell us? Because it was a secret in life, and even after death, it's still a secret? Whoa. Ooh. That was weird. He said something right there. Yeah. It's it, he said it's limb, it's limb or something like that. If you were mean to the people while they're alive, you're not going to bully us while we're here. And if we can, we'll take them out of here. Send them where they belong, and then you can sit here all you want with the guilt from what you did when you were alive. Can you say that what you said earlier? You said it's Lim or something like that. Can you say it clear? Is his name Lim? Is that his, nick is that his nickname? Who's the mean man? Who is it? Who is that? What's his name? Feeling that anger again. He's not, he's not happy. Don't be afraid of him. Okay, so I, one of the things I think I just saw in my mind's eye, I saw the elderly lady's hand like on a chair, and I just saw his fist bang right down on the arm. Mm. Is that what he did to you? Is that what you just showed me? 
Would he punch you on your arm and your hand? Hand. It just yeah. said hand. Dude. Hand, yeah. Oh my God. What about the hand? Tell us about the hand. What do you do to your hand? We're here to help. You can tell us your story. Ooh, you hear that? It said quiet. It's all quiet. It said quiet. Yeah, try to tell me to be quiet. Please. I dare you. Stand up to a lot worse than you, dude. Where does the mean one like to hang out? Does he hang out in the attic? I think so. So I can feel it up there when he walks up there. Is he in the attic, spirits? Yes or no? Took my ring. Oh yeah. Did he steal some of your jewelry too? Uh huh. Did I say uh huh? Like what that? jewelry did they did he steal from you? That sounds like it would be something typical to pull it out. Ooh. You getting angry? Well, we're not handicapped elderly people. And our muscles are our spirituality. So you don't have an issue with trying to do that to us. Regan. Regan? What was that? Yeah. Regan, Regan. Was that his name? Ooh, I hate when I do that. Is that his name, Regan? Is that his last name? He just shifts somebody, dude. Wow. He said, shush. That's it. Is that him trying to shush us? What? I got ice cold in this room. Where should we go next? Oh shit, man. There's something all around me, dude. Woo. Who's beside me? Answer? We didn't hear the question. Got it. Got it. And, and um, creepy voice. We'll be up there in a little bit. I want to charge up here before we go up there. Who's Mr. Mean Guy? There's a guy here who wears a hat, too. So I just saw a shout out to the left of me, to my purple again. What did I just see to the left of me? Fight. Fight? I heard, I heard die. Die? Yeah. Is he? Is he circling me because he's not happy? Hi. Hi. Who said that? Who's the woman that said hi? Hey. hey. Now we got a man saying hey. Who say hey? I thought one said hey. 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 It's like the woman said hi and the man said hey. Yeah, that's what we want. We want to talk with all of you. Upside down. Upside down. Or excited. Or excited, yeah, maybe. Well, it says, so they're talking so weird and fast. Who's excited or who's up? What did you say? Upside down, excited? What did you say? Where are you at right now?
How many people are in the attic? Wow, man. I'm not connected to her shit. I, I feel like, she, like, I don't know if it's her, if she's still connected to me. Like, she's writing a message to try to get to someone to get the help and help to, to, to know what's happening to her. Wow. Yeah. But she's stuck in here. She, she can't, can't. And she wanted to get the message to somebody for what was going on in here to help her. Like a prisoner. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm getting chills just thinking about it. Who's the old woman that needs help? Tell us her name, or you can tell us your name if you're here. Say it loud. Scream it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Were you trying to write something to get a message to someone to help you get out of this place? Free. To be free. Was the mean one confiscating your messages? Were you being held, you were being held prisoner here against your will? Sounds like a mountain. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're in the mountains. Are you buried on the mountain? Were they trying to cover up abuses here? We're just trying to find out your story. We need to help you, so we need to know more. You will? What did you write on that piece of paper? Okay, that's okay. What floor of the house did you stay on? The old woman. Well, I was totally trying to help some, her and whoever else because like I said, for them to come to me before coming here, yeah. they really need help. They need to be rescued here from this place when they were alive, yeah. and now even after death. Well, it's like we run into these, you know, bully spirits, whatever you want yeah. to call them, and they, they like to control the other spirits a lot of times. Oh, I mean, if you think about this, if there was, if there's truly a guy, an orderly type guy that abused patients, and he doesn't want to be accountable for his, the guilt and the, how he affected poor people in life. So they're yeah. sticking around and be stuck here. And then those people are suffering too. And then they're both trapped in this the thing. But then he's a controlling energy. He said hide. Are we supposed to hide from you? Ooh. Who likes to... Who likes to... Who's the one that likes to bully people and control them and beat them up a little bit? Tell us your name. Yeah, she's just saying he beat me. He beat me. You like to smack around the old folks, didn't you? Ooh. That make you feel like a man smacking around elderly people? People that couldn't defend themselves? What's that squeaky noise? I don't know, dude. Almost like the noise from a bed or... Yeah. I don't know. There it is again, man. You like to intimidate old folks? Is that what you like to do? You hear that? Yeah. Yeah, yes. Inside of that squeaky noise. Tell us your name, tough guy. Yeah. 
You like you like to intimidate women that come in here too, don't you? I got a lot of stories from women running out of here and, and different things. And, and, and feeling intimidated. You like to do that? The real question is, what do you think about us taking these poor people away from you? Mm. We're going to take them to the true hospital that will take care of them for an eternity. Hello, Karen. Yeah, I don't do a lot of live anymore, so <laughs> every now and again. Come up, we're gonna to move to a different room in a minute. Whoa. Pat, are you telling me Sam? Bring it. <laughs> yeah, could have been there. That's all right. Pat, are you the elderly woman? Is that is that you? Pat. Pat. Yeah. All right. Pat, did you die in this house? Did he do did he injure you so severely that you died? Whoa. Animal. I'd probably call him an animal. Yeah. He was was he an animal? What did he do to you, Pat? I didn't see that yet. I wouldn't want it either. I, I see him smacking them around and intimidating them. And just being a sick, twisted mother, you know? I don't know. I was, off on it, I I was sitting in a chair. It's like, I literally felt surrounded. I was connecting on such a high, <coughs> high level. It was intense. If you're angry with us being here, you want us to leave, make a loud noise, or slam the door. Dude, well, as soon as we sat down in that room over there, I heard like noises over by the stairs and a lot of shuffling and heavy something in here in this room. And as soon as I sit down in this chair, I start to feel it again. This energy. Who's the hateful person in, in this house? The spirit, the hateful spirit, likes to intimidate. I'm not going to stop asking until you tell us your name. I feel like she just showed me that she pulled out her tooth as if like she punched it. Jesus. Yeah. Did you lose a tooth from him punching you? Did he punch you? Ooh, what a scream. Man, I sit down in the chair, the energy pulsating. Mm -hmm. You do have a mirror right behind you, too. Oh, that was that. What? What was that? I'll find you or I'll find him or something like that. Did this orderly man in white? 
Punch him in the face. He said Morgan. Fan boy. Say that. Say that again. Ooh. Oh, dude. Said mirror, didn't it? Are you in the mirror? So shadow and camera here. I think it was the Oh, seen it. He just said seen it. Yeah. Oh my god. Dude, I'm like getting confirmation of everything. Mm -hmm. I'm like seeing and feeling right after it. It's insane. Are you using that mirror to travel back and forth in that little area right there? Something. If you like to beat or abuse these patients, touch one of these devices on the chair or the table. He did. Do it again. Punch him in the face. Did he punch these patients in the face and some of the elderly people? Did he punch you? Did he hurt you? Did he touch one of these devices? Want us to leave? That's one of the devices. Oh, oh that's a woman screaming. Did he just hurt you? Is he hurting you right now? What do he do to you? Oh, dude, it's got like pain in my heart, dude. That's I was getting. You know, she's I gonna breathe and. What did he just do to you? Is he preventing you from speaking more? That was weird. We're gonna move rooms in a few minutes, so now's your chance to tell us something. Did you hear him, dude? Yeah. He said, got her. Well, I was distracted because I can really see what this lady looks like. Though. He just said, got her. What did you do to her? Fight. Fight? Sounded like it. I, did, did I, can people... see, I can see her in front of the mirror and she's brushing her hair. She really likes to brush her hair. I see her doing it. She had like almost she was happy doing it. I mean, as all women would be yeah. happy doing that, but I, I don't know. She was, I, that's what I just saw. Did he punish people for not doing what he wanted them to do? If he caught you doing something, did he beat you? What piece of jewelry did he steal from you? All right, guys, I'm gonna have to go charge. My battery's going down and say, um, I'm just gonna keep it running though. I'm gonna throw the plug in on it.
Throw the donations up, please, if you can, on my PayPal. Anything helps. Let's see if I can pull it up. That's bizarre. All right, so I'm going to leave this sitting here for a little while, guys. You got to run some, do some charging here. So you'll be able to see in there for now. All right, I'm going to run this gateway. That Eric Connor built for me.
Hello. It's me? Who's me? Larissa, Are you, did you die in this house? Who's the mean man? Mr. Heyman, are you here with us right now? I don't know if you guys saw that, but I saw something over there. Kind of freaked me out. It was like a white something darted in that doorway over there. 
Who did I just see go through the door over there? Tell me on the box. Who was that? Who just ran across the hallway into that room we were just in? People. Well, give me a name. Can you tell me someone's name? What can you tell me? Hmm. I'm gonna get the obvious too. Any of the Heyman family here with us? A woman, what's the woman's name?
All right, I'm running the obvious to obvious five guys. Spit out five words right off the bat. Scrape, hidden, frank, and ah. Who, who, I just got the name Frank. Who's Frank? It just said Frank on the box. It repeated it. So it said it on here. You can see it. Can Discernment. Run. Industry. Yeah, Mr. Heyman was in industry. He was responsible for bringing the railroad in here. Burning. Burning. This town burned in the Civil War, guys. The whole town got set on fire. Along. Along what? Zinc. They used zinc for explosives, didn't they? Alive. Fog. Venus. That's bizarre. What was Mr. Heyman's first name? Never class. Eight nickel plant. So bizarre. Tell me who Frank was to this house. Just said Rebecca to mother. Work. Ooh. Rebecca, mother, and work. Is Rebecca here with us? Did Rebecca die in this house? Yes or no? Rebecca, are you here? Oh shit, the rim pod's going off in the other room. Happy. Suddenly. Stone. Dude, it's going crazy in there. I'm gonna try to get you guys in there. Crazy. Battery's going dead, dying guys. Let's see how much battery I got left. Seven percent. All right. All right. So I'm gonna. We've been going an hour and a half, exactly. So I'm gonna stop this feed and charge up and go from there. Okay. So you can watch Sean's feed on uh, Sean D. Austin on YouTube. Watch his feed. He'll be going live. His backup battery is working. Mine's been a pain in the butt tonight. So I'm going to charge up, and I'll see you guys uh, soon. Thanks for watching, and half an hour, I'll be back on. Talk to you later.